G'day, I'm Al McGlashan and welcome to Club Marine TV. Now you're new to boating. Boating is one of those awesome pastimes because it gets you on the water on days like this. But there are also a few inherent dangers that we have to deal with. So I'm going to tell you a few tips and techniques that will make you safe on the water. Number one, it's a duty of care. Now firstly, you have a duty of care to the people on your boat. You're the skipper. Secondly, and most importantly, you also have a duty of care to other users on the water. You need to play it safe and manage anything that you can influence, any dangers. Secondly, know your boat. Know the characteristics of your boat because every boat is unique. Make sure your boat is seaworthy, registered if required, and suitable for the types of waters that you're going to use it on. Make sure the engine is in good order, serviced, and become familiar with your boat's fuel consumption and range and determine your fuel needs. Load your boat safely within the limits. Now, this just doesn't apply to all your gear that you stow, which you must stow correctly. It also applies to all the crew, to everyone on board. And position, because you as a skipper, position everyone so the boat is balanced. And of course, tell them when you're accelerating or deaccelerating. Discuss your safety equipment. Before I even go to sea, I give a safety brief for the whole crew. What use is good safety equipment if you don't know how to use it? What is it like to wear a personal flotation device in the water? How does your fire extinguisher work? Do you know how to ignite, hold and use distress flares? How do you protect against exposure if you're capsized? But also, have an emergency plan. How would you deal with a person falling overboard, a leaky boat, an onboard fire, running out of fuel or a motor breakdown? Tell the crew what's going to happen in case of an accident. It's just like on a plane. Yeah, Romeo, that. This is Drug Zone. We'll be fishing on the shelf and our ETR. Discuss your trip preparation. Of course, you're looking at weather and all these other factors, but you also want to let people know where you're going, what your plans are. So if you're going offshore, let someone know where you're going and what time you're coming home. Alrighty, just spoken to Coastal Patrol and the weather's gonna be beautiful. A little bit of wind. And don't forget the weather. The weather plays a really important role with all boating. So check the forecast, check it again, check multiple forecasts to give you as much information to give you the safest day on the water. And then there's the rules and regulations. Make sure you're up to date with everything. Review speed limits and the voyage system. And keep a good lookout for dangers and other boats. It's these little points that will play a critical role if something does go wrong. I don't, don't like to play. And finally, make sure everyone's comfy because everyone wants a good day in the water. Take items such as sunscreen, hats, sunnies, wet weather gear, warm gear, change of gear, adequate food and water, and spare lines. Look at the conditions and try and drive to make it as comfortable ride as possible because we all want fun on the water.